Okay, here's your problem. So what you want to do first is go into your course and then go down here to um, point estimate for confidence interval for proportion using Excel. All right. Oops. Oh, that's the video. You could watch the video, okay, if you want. Uh, but the document is down here. So watch that if you want to. I mean, this will basically explain what I'm explaining now. Point to go to Microsoft Excel documents, point estimate for a proportion, open it up. Okay, all right, enable that in. Okay, so <clears throat> what you want to do is now go back to your problem. All right, and you want to put the sample size in here 183. Okay, and your confidence level here is point. 9.8, okay, 98% confidence, and your P, they gave you that here, P is 0.35, okay, so put 0.35 in here, all right, so <clears throat> now um, what this tells you to do, like read this, you have to manually write round the P, it says round it to three decimal places, well 0.35 round it to three decimal places is 0.35, so you do that here, okay, and then you round your margin of error to three decimal places. That's 0.082, okay? So then your lower number is 0.268, as you can see here is their answer. And the higher number is 0.432, which you see right here. And this particular one wants the answer in um, just in parentheses with the lower number first, comma, higher number second, and parentheses. Okay, let me know if you have any questions.